Okay, I'm going to talk on this this first ball I showed you, the one with the uh, graphics on it, right here. Okay, I'm going to talk on it with one hand. You drummers out there can tell me if that's a good tone. Okay, now I'm kind of doing a balancing act here. Okay, what I got here are one of my plaster drum balls. They sound really good. And I don't know if you can make out the ringy rock drum uh, on there. Right next to it is Magnus, the, uh, the little doggy, the uh, pug. Hey, Meg, look this way. This way, dog. All right, here's the ball. I may go over there and try to use one hand. I have to be careful with a cat, because a cat likes to eat the strap. Uh, this ball makes really good echo effects. You can stick your head in there. Yeah, I'm right inside the ball now. The cat, the strap is is the swing in there. Hello, in the ball, in the ball. Okay, that was in the ball. Okay, I'm gonna stop it for right now. Okay, over here is a really big ball. It's not the lightweight version uh, like the one I just showed you. But it's on a cart that will haul a thousand pounds. The ball is hollow, not that heavy, but it's strong enough that my uh, medium-sized daughter can crawl inside of it. Anyway, and down below is a ball very similar, almost identical to the other one, but with a smaller opening. It has a more ringy sound to it. It's a little bit thicker.